Time now for the NTV Sports Desk. Professional volleyball coming to the state of Nebraska, more specifically the city of Omaha. And right now, I am privileged to be joined by Husker great Gina Mancuso Prosaski. Gina, thank you very much for giving us a couple minutes tonight. Absolutely. It's my pleasure, and I'm super excited to talk about this all. And Gina, well, let's get right to it. Tell us about you signing this week, announced on Monday, uh, with the new Omaha professional squad. Which, what, what are you looking at when it comes to this new big team out in Omaha? Yeah, um, I've said it a thousand times already, but I'm sure I'll say it ten more thousand times. This is a dream come true. Um, having to have played professional volleyball, being forced to go overseas, it's a lot to sacrifice. And sure, it's a great experience and you learn so much, you meet so many friends and, you know, get exposed to different cultures. But being able to play in your home country for the first time ever is seriously such a dream come true. And I can speak for myself, but I can also speak for several other volleyball players in the country that we are so excited about this opportunity and this experience um, come early January, 2024. This is going to be a total game changer and we we cannot wait until January. We wish we could get started right away. Well, tell me a little bit about what it means to not only be playing professionally in America, but in Nebraska of all things, especially for somebody like you. Yeah, again, that just adds to the dream. Um, being born and raised in Omaha and being a former Husker, I know firsthand just the fan base that we have here, which is totally incredible, and you really can't find it anywhere else. So being able to play yet again in front of those fans is going to be such um, – it's going to be seriously the coolest thing. Um, I never thought that I could experience that again because, you know, I'm 10 years out of college. I never thought I would have that opportunity. And here we are, here I am being able to to play for them yet again. It is it's just, I feel speechless, really. It's, it's going to be completely incredible and awesome. And um, like I said, we know how how strong of a fan base we have here, and we know how um, people love, love volleyball in the state of Nebraska, and so we cannot wait to perform for them again. Last night, I had a chance to talk to head coach Shelton Collier uh, about building the team and doing recruiting and getting ready for the season. Tell me a little bit about what it means to get to play for Coach Collier in your role. Yeah, I mean, Coach, I, I still need to meet him face to face in person. I can't wait to shake his hand, but just the communications we've had, it's its very easy to talk to him. And he seems like a very uh, passionate coach, which is super exciting. I can say in my experience as a professional, you don't always find those. You're not always fortunate to have those. And so seeing that in Coach Shelton is just already such a breath of fresh air. And I can't wait to get in the gym with him. And I know he's been working around the clock, um, try, you know, working to build this championship team, which I fully believe um, we're on our way there. Um, so I just I have a lot of trust in him already. And um, like I said, couldn't be more excited to get in the gym with him. Do you know how the schedule goes? Not necessarily who you play each week, but how the structure of the schedule will work or how many months you play or how all that stuff works out? Yeah, so I think there's some details that still need to be finalized. However, we do know for certainty that the season will be um, January 2024 and it will conclude um, with a championship match in the middle of May 2024. Um, we do know that there's a guaranteed um, 24 matches, so it'll be 12 home, 12 away, um, and then there will be additional games um, should you make it to the finals and the playoffs, which I know Team Omaha will. We talked about the whole 90,000 fans coming into Memorial Stadium first time ever trying to set a record. They will, by the way. Uh, but that coming at the end of August, you know everything it is to about Husker fans and what volleyball means to the state. But coming off of something like that, just a mere months after that, what do you think that's going to do for you and your team and this league in general, especially when it comes to Cornhusker State folks? 90,000 people, are you kidding me? Leave it to Nebraska to do that. It is gonna be a crazy amount of energy in that stadium. I will be there, I can't wait to experience it. 
I think that will just only help catapult this um, inaugural season of a pro league in the United States. And um, I know it will have so much momentum. And so hopefully we can just feed off of that and, and truly um, get all of those fans in that stadium super excited um, for just, yeah, it, it won't be the Huskers. It'll be something entirely different. But like I said, they are true volleyball fans. They have the knowledge. Um, they have the passion. They, they're they invested in the team. So we, we just want to feed off that momentum. And um, we're really looking forward to it. And I know that all the fans will come through. Well, we hope so. Husker great Gina Mancuso Prosaski, thank you so much for giving us a few minutes tonight. Oh, absolutely. My pleasure.